yet another episode of the unhighlights isn't freedom of religion a basic right for any democratic country should we be worried about meeting and interacting with people of other religions Well, that seems to be the latest agenda on the mind of many politicians. Religion is a personal preference, and us Indians have always been commended for the diversity in our cultures and languages. However, all of this seems to be changing as politicians have been trying to fuel hate between various religions. Recently, Bajrang Dal leader Mithu Nath. want hindus by saying that any hindu seen visiting churches for christmas will be beaten is this really how political leaders who are elected and contesting to run our country are expected to speak to its citizens the very people who have given them voice by trusting them to take the right steps to help our country progress are belittling our religion and turning us against each other This comes just weeks after the start of another religious controversy of the Love Jihad law. Many have been hearing the politicians' comments towards religion and hoping that they will never become a reality. However, almost 10 people have already been arrested in the anti-conversion law in Uttar Pradesh. Religious comments like these have been only instigating religious hate among people of all communities why is it that when common people raise their voices towards anything wrong then they are beaten jailed and taken to court however when politicians and people in power constantly create hatred in a country already battling for religious freedom their remarks are ignored and tucked under the carpet isn't it time that we choose the right people to lead our country and make the right impact in the minds of our young generation how long are we going to ignore the comments made by any religion and proudly call ourselves a democratic country all while knowing within that the power of this country lies with our politicians and not with the people that's all for today i'm abhil lakravala Thank you for watching TNS News. While we love bringing the news to you, we would like to remind you about our initiative for citizen journalism. We cannot be everywhere, and we would like for you to report anything that you feel we need to cover or acknowledge any good work that you see around you. Do write to us on the given email address with your stories. Don't forget to like share and subscribe to TNS you can also visit our website for more detailed news bye bye